Good afternoon. It is one o'clock and it is 32 degrees outside and we are driving through the magnificent island estate in Hartepiaspo Dam. And I'm just doing a quick drive through to show you what the estate is all about. It really feels like you are somewhere out of this earth because we have an amazing mountain right next to us and then we have this massive dam being hard to pierce for dam and then we have an estate that is built with canals and your property is uh, ideally situated on a canal you can hop on a boat you can hop on a canoe you can enjoy the absolutely magnificent walks and swims and uh, what do you call it when you're on a boat in the canal Boating. Boating. Michael, rowing. you rowing. Okay, so I've got Michael here with me and he's helping me do this uh, house tour that uh, we're going to introduce you to shortly. Also, want to show you what this estate is all about. Look at that view. Absolutely magnificent. Modern houses townhouses you have your own swimming pools and you have the mountain where else can you think of do you have a beautiful mountain and a big body of water nearby and all the properties cost multiples of millions of rands can you think of any other place in south africa well i would say cape town is a thought where people <laughs> millions and millions of rands to own a property because they have a stunning mountain right ahead of them where they can do walking, trailing, you can, they can do biking, uh, there is even a very scenic, what do you call those lifts? Cable car. Cable car and um, it is really one of the, the most favorite holiday destinations if you want to be an hour away from a holiday for Joburgers and Pretoria people for Gautengers. I love going to the cheese farm here, selection of cheeses and from there you can take on some mountain bike trails as well as walking trails but truly there are so many venues here. There's uh, the Taba trails, they, they are multiple, I can't even name them all. And what we've got here is the Islands Estate and we are about to present you with a stunning house. It's a three bedroom house with its own little swimming pool, access to the canals, a patio, braai area. And all of this is your holiday destination, home away from home. Any thoughts, Mikey, on what you have seen so far of the estate? Um, it's actually a bit like Cape Town, you know. Oh, does it remind you of Cape Town? So. Yeah, it's got mountains <laughs> and uh, millionaire homes. And you don't even need to be a multiple, multiple, multi-millionaire. You just need 3.6 million and you can buy a gorgeous three-bedroom home from us. We're now going to head for the main road. But as you can see, the island estate has smaller townhouse setups. It's got big houses. Of course, Hartepiaspo Dam is a massive built-in environment. It's a town with multiple gorgeous private schools. Many people move into the area simply because of the quality of the education that you can get here and be in touch with nature all at the same time. There are stunning shops here. I personally love the windmill. In fact, we're heading for it now. We're gonna buy a lot of fresh produce. In fact, we often buy more than we shoot, but we just have to when we're there because everything looks so fresh and so yummy. And it truly is cheaper than uh, filling up half a trolley in Gauteng. What you also get to do is all the various water sports in Harties. But personally for me, it's the hiking. We've done a few trails with Mikey here and we've loved every single one of them. 
very uh, scenic and uh, calming. I personally can't wait to go to the windmill and fill up my fridge with mangoes and then eat them all as fast as is possible. Let's just take a quick turn around here and have a look at this bridge ahead of us. I like the fact that all the properties are very modern and of course winter time it gets quite cold in here but uh, it is totally worth it because you do get to enjoy a full season then. You've got a full winter and you've got a very hot summer and in the heat of summer what better way to spend your day than very close to water. The estate is busy developing as we speak. You can see there's a lot of construction going on. There are a few stands still left for sale. It's a massive estate, so it has so much to offer. And it is already so beautifully developed in terms of greenery and parks and uh, just the views from every single spot where we are here. Such a pleasure to drive around here. Indeed. I'm also loving what they've done with these bridges here, going over the canals. The entirety of the estate is very nautically themed. So if that's your style, then uh, this estate is for you. Islands Estate. And thinking of what other awesome activities one can uh, enjoy in Hartis. There's an elephant sanctuary here. There's a cheetah sanctuary. They do animal rehabilitation. There's also a monkey sanctuary, which is where Michael, who is now a grown man, um, gave up his dummy to the monkeys at uh, a tender young toddler age. Mm. I wonder if there's a monkey out there walking around with your dummy still. Maybe. Going to the cheetah sanctuary and there's also, you can, uh, you get to observe uh, wild dogs here. Um, it's, uh, it's really a very special experience. Wild dogs, you say? Those are quite rare. I've actually never seen a wild dog in my life. That would be a very unique experience for someone such as myself. And I'd also love to go there at some point. Maybe we should organize this for this December holiday. After all, it's only an hour drive away from Gauteng. Sounds good to me. And another favorite spot out here is the cheese fondue restaurant. What is it called? African Swiss. African Swiss. Maybe we'll combine the wild dog experience with uh, some uh, cheese fondue sampling. Indeed, that sounds very good. So that's it from us. A quick tour of the island estate in Hartipiers Dam. Thank you very much and watch our tour of our house for sale here. Don't miss it. Come and have a look.